Hi, welcome back to Cooking with Grandpa. Today we're going to make homemade chocolate syrup. Right. We're going to start with 16 ounces of sugar. Sounds like a lot of sugar, but we're making a nice syrup. We're going to put that in a tree quart pot. I'm using a tree quart pot because this has a tendency to boil over. And with that sugar, we're going to put in 14 ounces of water. And we're going to give that a shot of corn syrup. That helps prevent the sugar from recrystallizing. Now I'm going to put in about three ounces of cocoa. And put that in this bowl here. And in that, we're going to mix about six ounces of water. And we're going to make a paste out of this. I'll come back when it's made. Up. I'll show you how I make the paste. As you see, I switched the bowl to a little bigger bowl because I want to be comfortable with it. And I'm going to add this at a time. You can't throw it all in there because you'll have lumps that you'll never get out. And with a spatula, you make start pounding it down and making a paste. And I'll show you when it's done how it looks. But don't throw all the water in. Just go a little at a time. Okay, as you can see, we kind of got it down to almost a paste. And make sure there's no lumps. Keep pressing it down. I don't think we're going to need a little more water, so we'll leave that out. Just a drop more, go ahead. That's plenty. Okay. So now we have our paste. Nice paste, no lumps, we hope. Next procedure now, after we have our paste all set up, we'll, you could do this a little bit as it was making your paste. We're going to boil this until it gets to about 220 degrees. Leave the cover off and I have a... Okay, I'm checking my syrup right now. I want to get it to around 220. It's about 218 right now. It takes about a good five, six minutes according to the pot you're using, uncovered. Let's give it another few minutes. Okay, it's been about eight minutes. Let's see where we're at. It's 219. We're good. Have a wet brush on the side here and do your sides of your pot to clear off the crystals. The crystals. Let's check it out. I think that's close enough with 219. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we just add a drop or two of this into this. No, nah, we don't have to, it's not the temper on it, it's oh. just making it easier to move around. Now we take this and we put it in here. And we let this come to a boil 
and simmer it for a good 10 minutes. You gotta be careful that she doesn't boil over on you. That's why I'm using a bigger pot. I'm gonna leave the pencils. show you when it's about 10 minutes old. Okay, we're about 10 minutes into this and we're getting real close. You see how it forts up like that? You gotta be careful with it. When she's up to 219, 220 again. So we're kind of done here. Shut the fire off, and we're going to add three, three grams of salt, which is about a half a teaspoon, and about a half a teaspoon of vanilla. Take the flame and stir that in. And now you just have to put it in a water bath and cool it down, and then bottle it up, and you got it. I'd like to thank my grandson for helping me get this all out to you guys. So it's in the water bath and it's gonna get cooled and then we're gonna put it into the bottles. Bottles, yeah. This takes a while. Thanks for watching. Come back again and we're gonna do something different. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube videos.